He's fixing his wedgie again. Come on, man. You're a fully grown ass man. You know how, you know better than to fix you know never mind, let's keep let's keep going. So anyway, welcome to another part. I hope you enjoy this. Um We going to the the conference room yet? I want in. I heard there's donuts in there. One thing I gotta appreciate too is the stuff on the counter does change time to time. Oh, here's another thing too. There was a roll of toilet paper on the back of it and now it's missing. So I'm actually kind of feeling half lived in. And also this chair moves around a bit too. I mean. Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't... It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? Match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Anything. <laughs> Used to be we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. It's part of what makes the Animus so spectacular. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Hmm. Here, look, we could assassinate him. We're just neck breaker him, right? Just come up behind him. <laughs> Dead. Hey, like me stand this close? Probably not, right? <laughs> hey there, I'm Miles. Ah, oh, back in the machine. Mm. I can't remember. In Rogue, do you lay down on the Animus machine too? Wait, how's that work? No, wait, you're at your computer or something, right? How's that work? I can't remember. It's been a long time since I played Rogue, okay. Is this part 41? Oh, man. Why? To gain the advantage in combat. How many parts was bad company? Why am I running? I don't gotta run. I mean, my student, we have much to discuss. We are close, Altair. Robert de Sable is now all that stands between us and victory. It is his mouth gives the orders. His hand pays the gold. With him dies the knowledge of the Templar treasure and any threat it might pose. I still don't understand how a simple bit of treasure could cause so much chaos. 
The beast hath eaten his temptation given form. Merely look at what it's done to Robert. Once he tasted of its power, the thing consumed him. He saw not a dangerous weapon to be destroyed, but a tool. One that would help him realize his life's ambition. He dreamed of power then. Yes, and no. He dreamed, and still dreams, like us, of peace. But this is a man who sought to see the Holy Land consumed by war. No, Altair. How can you not see when you're the one that opened my eyes to this? What do you mean? What do he and his followers want? A world in which all men are united. I do not despise his goal. I share it. But I take issue with the means. Peace is something to be learned, to be understood, to be embraced. He would force it. And rob us of our free will in the process. Strange to think of him in this way. Never harbor hate for your victims, Altair. Such thoughts are poison and will cloud your judgment. Could he not be convinced then to end his mad quest? I spoke to him in my way through you. What was each killing if not a message? But he has chosen to ignore us. Then there's only one thing left to do. Jerusalem is where you faced him first. It's where you'll find him now. Let this final offering lend you strength. Go, Altair. It's time to finish this. Those are more of the same. Well, the weapon was on the desk. That's a patrol, but it's my guy, so it's okay. They have our patrol. Okay, now we gotta go to Jerusalem. And I don't wanna talk to the guy at the office because he's a jerk. He's very rude. He doesn't like Altair. Unfortunately, too, a lot of the places, there's a lot more people than houses. So where do all these people live? Unless they're all crammed really tight in these houses, like 20 people per house. Like at least you know, four more achievements during this segment of the game. Jerusalem the last time. Use free running to escape from a fight when exposed. Sprint to lose your enemies and jump through merchant stands to avoid the crowd.
Oh, that loading screen. This is taking forever. my scholars. Safety and peace, Altair. Upon you as well, brother. Seems fate has a funny way with things. So it's true, then. Robert de Sable is in Jerusalem. I've seen the knights myself. Only misfortune follows that man. If he's here, it's because he intends ill. I won't give him the chance to act. Do not let vengeance cloud your thoughts, brother. We both know no good can come of that. I have not forgotten. You have nothing to fear. I do not seek revenge, but knowledge. Truly, you are not the man I once knew. My work has taught me many things, revealed secrets to me. But there are still pieces of this puzzle I do not possess. What do you mean? All the men I've laid to rest have worked together, united by this man. Robert has designs upon the land. This much I know for certain. But how and why, when and where, these things remain out of reach. Crusaders and Saracens working together? They are none of these things, but something else. Templars. The Templars are a part of the Crusader army. Or so they'd like King Richard to believe. No, their only allegiance is to Robert de Sable and some mad idea that they will stop the war. You spin a strange tale. You have no idea, Malik. But tell me where they've been seen. I should be after him before he slips away. Three places I can say for certain. West of here, near both a guard tower and a hospital. And to the southwest, at the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. See what you can learn. I will do the same. I'll be quick as I can. Stay safe, my friend. hurt himself.
<clears throat> okay, so I was just eating some really loud, annoying, crunchy stuff. I hit mute on the microphone because you don't need to be hearing that. But it's very tasty. No, you don't understand. I have nothing. A few coins. All I ask is. <laughs> What he's so angry about. Where? Are we there? We must have come into the zone on accident. Looks like we did. Okay. Now, more of the same. Ah, well, that's going to be easy to clear this up. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'd be on the uh, here out, I guess, for. My family sick and dying. <laughs> You've crossed the wrong man. I am not a fan of the uh, green filter on this place. It'd be a gorgeous city, but the green filter makes it just weird to look at. I don't like it. Former here. Hmm. I'll come back to you later, pal. Flag. That is Wi-Fi punch, I guess. <laughs> Go ahead, I got a human shield. What are you gonna do, big guy? I got a human shield. Oh, that didn't work. Uh oh, these guys have taken offense. What was that? Okay, here it is. We gotta get up there. That's clearly a viewpoint. <laughs> Leave now. I can't leave. I'm doing objectives. 
Doesn't know how this game works. Let me guess, it thinks I'm saying sink like the kitchen or the bathroom. What's that extra dot at the end? See that? There are two assassinations of him? What's going on there? Okay, so there was no high point over there. There's a lot of people here on this one. We'll take care of it. True hero. There's always that really awkward, like they cut it wrong what after that soundbite. This is ten murder or loose. What's this? Again, you shouldn't be too surprised. Pile of corpses, that was me. <laughs> Be on the listen for uh, citizens in danger. That means the big guys are in on the scam. Oh, 
Like, I could hear the crowd react because, you know, dead guy just hit the ground. Well, he was alive before he hit the ground, of course. But after that, he's not so alive now. Anytime soon, either. You've done me a kindness, young man. Be assured, I won't forget it. God curse the one who's oh, done this. Terrible. Where are you? Oh, my God. 
Okay, so I just realized, um, uh, got 31 minutes. I, I was, I had it muted again because I was getting some nuts. Yeah, peanuts, cashews, raisins, it's trail mix. Very tasty. Okay, so when you come back next time, we're going to deal with, um, this. Also, climbing that ladder was too difficult. Yeah. Okay, so I'll see you next time. This is, this game is going way longer than I want it to. Fun though.